Um, I'm Justine Paul and I run Suffolk Market Events. Um, we founded the business in 2008 and it's continued to grow um, ever since. It started very much um, by accident really. We moved to Lavenham, we went to the farmer's market, really excited about eating good food and it was on its last legs. There were a kind of handful of storeholders, uh, half a dozen stores, probably a few customers coming through the door and we left thinking, oh crack it's quite sad. And it was Alex actually, he just said to me, why don't you do something about it? So I did literally kind of um, get my little bubble jet printer out and start printing on A4 posters, save the farmer's market. I uh, went around putting flies through everybody's doors, got online, begged people to come along, went to other markets, spoke to other traders. Um, so that was back in September 2008, uh, so I had my first farmer's market in Lavender Village Hall. And it's just grown since then. We now run six monthly farmer's markets and a bunch of other one-off food events and food festivals in Suffolk and in Essex. Yeah, I think there is definitely a real wave of um, confidence to come and shop outside, to shop local. Uh, people want to be able to face the person who's the producer. I think there's a lot um, in and around wanting to um, you know, see the person, um, chat to them. Um, and actually for me, I think it's, it's, like I say, it's all about wanting to shop outside. Um, so a real level of confidence to do that. People want local food and they want a good tasting local food, fresh produce, so that has been really good for us. We've, we've, yeah. The customers have been great, right? yeah. really yeah. supportive. You know, our markets are a community hub, uh, they're a place for people to gather and chew the fat, and I mean that's what markets have always been, and I, that's why I believe markets would always exist, because they're really important for communities. I was literally just talking to somebody now who said that throughout lockdown, the Friday market at Hadley has been the most important place for her because she's come here every single week and she's seen people, she's been able to say hello to people, she's been able to get shopping, she's been able to go home, she's felt less cut off and less desolate and I think that's really important. We're going to run a pilot course in March for six people um, where we're hoping to turn the idea into a functioning market store. And we've worked with lots of small scale producers, that's our real sort of work ethic is the people we work with are small scale but if we can start to grow tiny micro producers uh, that have never worked in that environment before, um, then for us that will be really special. So that's a sort of new bolt-on idea to some market events which we're going to be launching in March.